whole world changed one day when all these random cards started raining down everywhere. At first, they seemed harmless enough, so a bunch of us kids invented this cool new game. That's when we realized those cards weren't so harmless after all. They were packed with incredible powers from another world. My name is Dan, and together with my friends Bruno, Marucho, Julie, not to mention Mr. Hotshot himself, Shun, and Alice, we are the, the Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Bakugan, one goal, two worlds. What are you gonna do? The odds are stacked against you. Back against the wall, gotta give it your all. This is the final stand. The power's in your hands. Two worlds collide on the inside. You gotta fight for what's right before it's Girls just want to have fun. In the last episode, my parents and I moved into Dan's neighborhood into our new house. I invited Bruno and Dan over, and unexpectedly, this strange Bakugan who called himself Preya showed up. He was kind of cute. And then, Super Sync Sound Extravaganza dropped in. Super Sync Sound! What we didn't know was that they were sent by Masquerade to battle us and steal our Bakugan. Change of attributes! That is Preus' special ability. He can change his attribute at any time during battle. Battle intensity increasing to maximum strength. Preus attack! Good job, Preus. You were all was nothing. Time for lunch. Hey, Dan, how about you and I spend a little quality time together? Oh, yeah. I'm up for anything. All right. Time to get busy. Bakugan, rock! Ready to battle, Danny? <sighs> Aqua Sphere Ripper, stand. Okay, her Fear Ripper is sitting at 300 Gs. But I got a sneaky feeling she's hiding a card and is gonna crank it up. Are you gonna battle or what? Yeah, yeah, just chill. Bakugan, roll! Bakugan, stand! Don't tell me that's your best move. You haven't seen nothing yet. Hey, it's your funeral, boy. I think he's playing you, Jen. Oh, please. Like you could do better? Hey, girlfriend, you ready to party? Uh... Bakugan, crawl! Get out of the way, bud! Uh, oh, sorry! Oh, stand! Ah. Battle status Saurus at 320 G's, Falconeer at 300 G's. Watch this, Marucho! Geekon, open! Vulcanier, power increase. Now you're mine! Ability card, activate! Time to combine Subterra and Aqua. Saurus to 420Gs. Oh, snap! I'm gonna be cream! Harder to take when you're beaten by a girl. We win, you lose. We win, you lose. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you lost, Danny. Can't believe they sent my Bakugan to the Doom Dimension. That is true, but you let your guard down. Huh? Now I get it. By diagonally combining the attributes of their Aquas and Subterra ability cards, they simply overpowered you. And that means they blocked me from combining the powers of my Bakugan, leaving me a sitting duck. You knew? So why didn't you tell me, Marucho? Hey, simmer down, mister. Or I'll have to show you who's boss around here. Man. There is a solution. Preus has the ability to change attributes on his own. 
Draco's right, Dan. If Prius changes into Subterra mode, then he'll be in a diagonal relationship with Aqua. Just me. And if he changes to Darkest mode, then he aligns with Pyrus, which is me. Now you got it. This isn't over. We can still do this. Bakugan pitted against each other. Then that means... Tsunami! Their combined powers created a tsunami wave. And it could be worse if they engaged their Aqua Siege. Here's the deal, guys. Our only hope is to defeat them, and the quicker the better. No, Dan. We must secure our position and make a stand against them. Are you nuts? Trust me. I believe my calculations are correct. Uh... Yeah, okay. I think I know what you're getting at, so we better get started before we lose another back of gun. Game card! Set! Back of gun! Wrong! Serpentoid, stand! Game card! As it's your plan, it's your move. I believe it's fairly simple. As you can see, we have your Pyrus, my Aqua, and if we add the light attribute Chaos onto the battlefield, it will complete our line of defense. Fire, water, light, the triangle of the hexagonal magic circle. I am totally clueless, but I'm guessing that whatever this triangle thingy is, it'll boost our power. Something like that. We just need prayers. He's our Chaos source. Me? You're kidding! You're saying you want me to go in there and risk being sent to the Doom Dimension? No, not me! No way! Yes! <laughs> so, are you all ready to go? No! But we're counting on you! Well, all right, fine. I play? Be serious! You mind? This is my party! <laughs> Change of attribute! What do you think? Too much? Get it out! You idiot! You morphed into darkest! We need chaos! I can't do anything right, can I? Hmm. Not the brightest Bakugan. Hey! I heard that! Gate card open right now! Source power level increase. A oh, little trouble here! Someone call 911 if it's not too much trouble! Hooray! Oh. Water refrain negated. What's going on? Do something, Marucho! Ability card activate! Time to combine Darkest and Pyrus! What? I'm freaking out, man! Prius 400 Gs. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, that was too close for comfort. I almost lost my Prius. Luckily, I remembered to link up the Pyrus and Darkest forces at the last minute to pull it off. Oh, please. I was in control the whole time. Why are you ungrateful <laughs> little black gun? A very careless display, Prius. Hey, lighten up, would ya? After all, I did win. Girlfriend, it was Max playing against a sister who backs what they're saying. You the bomb, girlfriend. And this battle is about to end. Gigard ah! set! Bakugan brawl! Aqua siege! Aqua siege? I had a 
funny feeling they weren't finished with us yet. I love this game. <laughs> hey, girl, time to get your swerve on. Ability card activated. Tsunami way. Nothing in the Bakugan handbook about giant waves. Oh. Hey, you guys, that's cheating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry about that, boys. Yeah, our bad. And the brawlers will be back right after these messages. And now, back to Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Hey, you twisted twins, you cheated. <laughs> <laughs> Time to crank it up a notch. Present standings. Battle tied at one game each. So what do you say we play by their rules? Yeah. Game card set! It's up to you, Drago. Bakugan strong! Stand! Okay, gate card open! Ring of Flame! Drago, power increase. Do it, Drago! I boosted your power to 420 Gs! And your fire attribute should squash that bug big time! Ability card, activate! Hooking up Subterra to Aqua! Oh no! Centipoid power increase. Ability card, activate! Attract door! Watch it, boys! We've just linked up our Bakugan to battle together. Impossible! That makes it two against one! There's no way we stand a chance! Challenger increase to 530Gs. Sorry, but you lose again. <laughs> Not yet! Huh? Watch and learn! Counter ability card activate! I'm betting if I reverse the diagonal relationship and hook up Pyrus with Darkest, it neutralizes the combination attack. <laughs> Ready or not? Oh, you hoo Mr. Dragon. I heard a rumor you've been looking for a dance partner. You're wearing on me, Preyus. Hey, no fair. Since when is it okay for Preyus to crash the party? Don't you know it's against the rules? I want to launch an official protest. According to the rules, they can use a diagonal what? move to counterattack. <gasps> Change of attribute! Darkus! <laughs> it's working! <laughs> Sensing power surge. <laughs> Drago, ability card activate! Boosted Dragon! Combine power to 1,020 Gs. Yeah! yeah! We did it! Did we? Yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, man. At least we're popular. Huh? <laughs> Too easy. Come on, so tell me, guys, did you win? Mm-hmm. I know you love this game, girls, but if you ask me, battling for that creep masquerade is not the smartest thing in the world to do. Well, then again, if you ever want to hook up... Uh, who cares about mascara when there's two hunky homeboys like you to battle? Yo, yo, girl, we gotta roll. <gasps> That's right! I completely forgot all about it. We've, We've got, got a show tonight! tonight. Super, Super Sound, Sound Extravaganza Rock!
I fully realize my understanding of your language is limited. However, I do believe the word for those two would be flakes. But they were mildly amusing creatures, to say the least, Drago. What concerns me is the one you call Masquerade. Well, if you ask me, I say we challenge that varmint to a showdown. Well, Drago, what do you think? Come on, you guys, fail! I believe now is the right time for me to explain about the universe I come from. You mean Vistroya, right? The place where all Bakugan come from. That is correct. Vistroya is a vast dimension comprised of six attribute worlds. You humans would know them better as fire, earth, light, the dark side, water, and wind. In the very center of our universe, there are two opposing cores. Infinity, the source of all positive energy, and the silent core, the source of all negative energy. These two opposing forces maintain the equilibrium of our dimension. But there was one rogue Bakugan who, in his lust for control, schemed to seize all of the power for himself. This had never happened in our universe before. His name was Naga, and his mission was to penetrate the core and seize the power. But this had never been done before. Somehow, however, he didn't succeed and he released all the negative energy. It has affected us and now it has spilled into your world. And everyone didn't live happily ever after. And that's it. Bye-bye. <gasps> oh. oh man, this is all starting to make sense now. All those cards must have fallen through some kind of wormhole or something into our world. And the crazy thing is, everyone who found them just thought they were some kind of game. Boy, were we ever wrong. No kidding. You think I came here for my health? Before Naga screwed everything up, I was just a cute, peace-loving Bakugan. Knuckle sandwich! Oh, why do we all just get along? Did anyone get the number of that bus? Well, the next thing I know, I wake up in your world. I was freaked! My past was a foggy memory. I only knew I had to find myself. Find the cute and cuddly prayas I remember deep down inside of me. A Bakugan who loved long walks on the beach, a warm fire, a good uh, book. Gee, Prayas, that's almost interesting, but you mind not interrupting again? Sorry, Drago. Now go ahead and finish your story. After Naga had disrupted our world, and before the Bakugan began entering into yours, there was one human who crossed over into Vestroya. Ah! A human crossed over? You're serious? Yes. And he was the one who showed Naga how to enter the center of the world. He opened the portal. That was the last I saw of Naga. Vestroya fell into a world of sheer madness the negative power overwhelming the minds and wills of the Bakugan who lived there. The violence escalated, and it seemed there would be no end to it. That is when I decided to enter your realm and put a stop to this insanity. When I crossed over, you were in the middle of one of your games. That's the first you saw of me, Daniel. Huh? Yeah, I remember. The vision I had a while ago, it seemed real. <laughs> Wow. So, how long have you been here, Tigrera? Just after Drago left Vestroya, I followed. I realized my world was about to collapse upon itself, and our only hope to save it was to come to your world. Just before I left, I saw the Infinity Core leaving Vestroya to enter your realm forever! Naga must have summoned it here. Now our mission is to return the two cores, otherwise Vestroya is doomed. For real? We must find the human who corrupted Naga's mind. But who is he? If I remember correctly, it's Michael. Michael who? <gasps> Whoa, hang on a sec, you guys. Where'd I put it? I just saw it here. Okay, you are not gonna believe this. Check this out. Yeah, uh, I hate to break it to you, but that's just your seventh grade science book. For your information, Runo, I'm not as stupid as you look. <laughs> Hey, just relax, Bruno. I think I know who Michael is. Is this the dude? <gasps> yes, that's him. That's him. That's Dr. Michael Gahabic, the multi-gazillionaire scientist. Last I heard is he went missing a couple of years ago. The guy's a total geek. <gasps> so 
what do you know about this guy? He needs a total makeover and quick before I... Would you zip it? You're not helping the situation with your lame jokes, Prius. Okay. I know this is going to sound kind of weird, but... Do you guys think it's possible that when this Dr. Michael went missing, he really crossed over to Vistroya? Mm. No, it sounds too far-fetched to me. Wait a sec. You think there's a connection between Masquerade and this, like, doctor guy? This is Hal G. How is my little plan coming along, Masquerade? Well, let's just say you have nothing to worry about, Hal G. <laughs> the more we battle, the more our Bakugans evolve, and soon the Infinity Core will be ours. <laughs> <gasps> After all these years... No, Grandfather Michael. You and Vistroya? It, it can't be! <sighs> yes, yes, the Infinity Core will be ours. Hey, this is Runo. And coming up on the next Bakugan Battle Brawlers, we head to the airport to pick up Alice. Even Dan is there, sorta. That's where we meet two brothers, Takashi and Kasuki, who challenge us to a brawl. Rucho is totally pumped about the battle, and everything starts out okay. But how does it end? Well, you'll just have to check it out for yourself on the next episode of Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Trust me, this one's gonna be wicked!